Florida's presidential preference primary is just four days away and already thousands have cast their ballots, including a lot right here on the Sun Coast. SNN's Kelly Rittenauer has a closer look. Sun Coast voters hoping to avoid the rush during the presidential preference primary next Tuesday take advantage of early voting options here in the Sunshine State. As of right now, real time, we have 14,614 people that have already voted. Sarasota County Supervisor of Elections Kathy Dent says the volume of early voters is so significant it's nearly cut the election day crowd in half. I think between absentee and early voting we'll have about 50 percent and then on election day we'll see the other 50 percent roll in. Despite the long lines during some periods, one voter says waiting still beats chaos on election day. It looks busy but it went really fast. I mean, we were only standing here maybe 10 minutes. Just beyond this poll distance marker, we have campaign supporters from both sides of the aisle who are hoping to make a last minute impression on early voters. There is a lot of support for Donald Trump. We are the voice for Rubio here. We were told, the Democrats, that we are supporting both candidates and that we are not to engage in any political discussions about either candidate. I've been here uh, every day since Saturday, 8 o'clock in the morning until the polls close. I will mention the Rubio people only came out today. I'm here to support people who have come out and give me the thumbs up for Rubio, just to encourage them and, you know, just know that they did the right thing. Okay, thank you so much for voting. Take care. Dent says she believes the excitement generated by both parties has attracted more voters to the polls. I'm thinking that, uh, that this is probably going to be one of the highest turnouts that we've had. Reporting in Sarasota County, Kelly Rittenauer, SNN, the Suncoast News Network.